Jose Chavez, better known as JP, is ready to walk the stage after earning his degree in computer science with a focus on cybersecurity. All the classes have been small and you've been, you're able to approach your professors and have conversations with them. JP transferred to UT Permian Basin after earning his associate's degree from Frank Phillips College in Dalhart. When deciding where he should go next, all it took was a quick Google search for most affordable universities in Texas. UTPB was like pretty high up there, so as soon as I got accepted, I was like, that's where I'm gonna go. Affordability is something UT Permian Basin is proud of. In fact, JP will be graduating debt free. But beyond that, he realized quickly, UTPB provides so much more. I came without knowing anyone here, so I wanted to get involved with stuff and there's a great opportunity to do that here. I have been in SGA for three semesters. I have been a RA for about six. Part of the RA Social Committee, Catholic Student Association, Baptist Student Ministry. You know, here at UTBB, we have as many of the opportunities as you would get at any other larger institution, but you are going to compete for those opportunities against a smaller pool of students. Some of those opportunities for JP also included a trip to Washington, D.C., representing the university. It was a surreal experience being from Perryton, Texas, with like a population less than 10,000 people. Going to D.C. paid for by the college and representing them, it was crazy. For JP, the trip came with another milestone, his first time on an airplane. Uh, Dr. Spurlock was, I feel like she kept on looking at me because she wanted, because she said I, she was in my shoes at one point. It was so special to be on the plane with JP on his way to Washington DC because the first time I ever went on a plane was when the university I was at sent me to Washington DC for a conference when I was a college student. So it was a real full, full circle moment for the both, for me, and I really loved sitting next to JP on the plane and sharing that moment. JP, like many other Falcons, is a first-generation college student. In fact, more than 40% of UTPB students are first-generation, meaning they're the first in their families to go to college. Recently, UTPB was designated a first-gen forward campus. And that's a designation we've been given because of our commitment to first-generation students. We're so committed to them because we know how much a college degree can change somebody's life and the life of their family. UTPB is also changing lives with our new tuition assistance program called Falcon Free. Falcon Free covers tuition and mandatory fees for those whose household annual income is $100,000 or less. 40% of our undergraduates for fall 2022 are Falcon Free. Falcon Free is transformational for so many students and their families. You know, our biggest barrier for students to attend college and to be able to enroll full time and, and keep on time to graduate at a faster pace is financial. And Falcon Free really changes that equation because it provides the necessary financial support for somebody to be able to give more of their focus to school. We served over 7,000 students last year. Uh, we had one of the highest freshman classes ever. We, we had the highest transfer class ever from our community college partners. And we know that, you know, that financial support is a, a real plus for those students. And we just want to make sure that we can keep that going in every way that we can so that more students can choose the University of Texas Permian Basin for their degree as well. Everybody here wants to help you succeed. President Woodley, I mean, it's crazy to just see her around campus and like so be so involved as a president. We do what we do at this university because of our students, and it's a, a, a pleasure to walk around campus and see them and to hear a little bit about their story and and uh, the challenges that they may have. And more you know, importantly, it's really a lot of fun to listen to what they love about the university. And it really warms my heart when I talk to students. They, they have good experiences here at the university and, and they enjoy uh, their experience. And that just makes me want to work harder every day to make sure that they're successful here. As for JP, he plans to stay in the Permian Basin and give back to the community that has helped him so much. UTPB's career services team was able to help JP land a summer internship at Stark Tech Group, which turned into a full-time job. 
JP, you were a gift that I didn't see coming. And I absolutely loved getting to know you as a student. And our time in Washington, D.C. really was incredibly special. Um, since then, I've been able to see you present your undergraduate research, see you as a student leader on campus, support your career aspirations, and it's been my great gift to be involved in your life. Thank you. My parents came from Mexico. It was always a big thing for my mom, for me to, for one of our people in my family to graduate. And so I actually finished it. And so trying to make them proud. Me siento muy feliz de poder hacer esto por mí, por mi familia y los que esperaron tanto de mí.